Hey guys, welcome back to the next tutorial and in this video I will show you how you can further customize these uh, dots or the uh, the scatter chart dot points over here. So just to give you a quick recap what we have done, we have uh, imported the libraries. After that we imported the data set using the pd.read underscore excel and then just have a look at the data at a high level. Uh, after that, we created a subset of data for sales and profit by creating this object orders underscore SF for these two columns. And uh, once it is done, uh, we created a scatter chart over here. So if I show you, uh, this data is the one which is getting the uh, from order underscore SF dot sales, this column, the sales column, and uh, for profit the Y column is coming and mode is markers. Now over here, uh, I will show you how you can further customize it by using the markers um, parameter. So marker is equals to, and here we will use multiple parameters. So we have to specify the dictionary. That's the format to do that. And uh, first thing is we can specify size. So let's specify let's say uh, 14 a bigger little bit bigger size and you can experiment with it and figure it out what is best once you have specified the size we can uh, specify the color which is uh, it can which can be anything like rgb 120 150 180 or it can be a hexadecimal within this single quotation that, so that would be something like uh, if i show you hash one two three FFF kind of a thing so you can experiment with uh, in place of RGB you can specify this as well all right let's specify another property which is uh, symbol it's equals to square and uh, that let's specify the line which is a borderline and for borderline again you need to use the dictionary with is equals to two and then you can experiment with it what how much width is required now the important thing is there are a lot many parameters even i don't remember a lot it's just with the practice that you can get to know all of these parameters but you can look at the documentation the plotly side which is plot dot lee if i open uh plot dot lee and uh, that will basically open the plotly side and down there you can see um the information about uh, the library gets getting python graphing library and all which will actually lead you in the direction of uh, where the documentation is so for example if i click it over here uh, that will tell me uh, basically a library here in the github and then a different types of charts that you can create the online documentation and that's where we basically see and figure it out the hundreds of properties which are there so you can actually go to its website and see these things and see it in action so once you are done let's execute this execute this execute this and create a figure and now you can see this particular chart which is having a default setting is like this and the one which for which we have made the customization is looking like this so this way you can further customize your chart based on your needs of your organization or or your visualization need to make it much more perfect and that's pretty much it and i'll meet you in the new video the new topic